everyone, time for another video review, and this is the Transformers War for Cybertron Siege Micromasters Road Handler and Swindler. Yes, you can see they are red and uh, gray sports cars. They are WFC-S4, and you can see right there behind them in the packaging. You can barely see them, but yeah, you can see them, their little symbols, a bit of artwork, and then their... And in the back, hey, look, there's a... There they are in their various modes and how they can be combined and all that stuff. Which we'll get to in a little bit as well. They also come with these instructions, which not as basic as the Battle Masters, but still pretty basic in, a, in their own right. Uh, they actually turn into the multi mech particle exhaust cannon, apparently. Also, mine was torn up out of the packaging for some reason. Whatever, it's just instructions, no big deal. Yep. Micromasters. Uh, these are based off the original, I best believe, the Race Car Patrol. I have the Race Car Patrol somewhere. I can't find them because, well, they're small and easy to lose. Surprise. Oh, uh, yeah, they're, um... Roadmaster and Swindler here. Or Road Handler, excuse me. Roadmaster. That's something completely different. Uh, but, yeah, uh, you know, kind of a loosely based on a Pontiac and a DeLorean, although very, very, very different from how it used to look, uh, which kind of disappoints me. This is what I'm looking forward to because, well, you know, I have Swindler and I'd like the, you know, I have a DeLorean and I want a DeLorean Transformer. And it's like, this doesn't really look like a DeLorean, unfortunately. And that's just a little disappointing. That just doesn't look like one uh, as much. I mean, it kind of has the shape, but it's all squared off and wrong. And the headlights are wrong. But, uh, yeah. You know, so, you know, it's a red and black, you know, a lot about symbol and stuff. Red and black Trans Am, I guess, or Firebird, whatever you want to say. Yeah, they're real small cars. They roll. They're basic. Yeah, they roll pretty decently, and there you go. Uh, transformation is also really simple. You just uh, crack it open, uh, unfold the back half, like so. Unpeg them from each other, take the hood, and fold it back behind, and untab the arms from the side. That's Road Handler. Pretty squared away. Swindler's much the same. Yeah, un unpeg the back half, from, have, unfold it, unpeg the legs from each other. Here, though, you take the uh, side, the, these parts, and untab them from the hood. These, and then take the hood and accordion it back a bit, like so, like that. And then the arms you untab from the sides and you can move them as much as you want and he's a little back heavy and there you go real basic they're pretty neat looking um there's a lot of detail cons to pop up particularly with the road handler here you got silver and yellow and blue pops up which isn't really there in the vehicle mode you got some blue and yellow here on him yeah they're uh, real basic they're real small um, they're slightly bigger, I believe, than the original MicroMasters. Not much bigger, though, but they're still pretty small in their own right. Uh, posability, no head movement. Uh, ball joint and shoulders, though. Uh, so forward and outward. A little hampered by the backpack. Ball joint and hips, forward and back. Knees, because of the transformation. Although, also notice a lot of these guys have... Um, Ball joints that just pop apart on the legs. They pop apart really easily. They don't really have a good grip on the... The ball joints do not have good grip. Oh, yeah, there's a waist swivel as well. Again, ball joints do not... It's all pretty much the same here, although he's more hampered because the weight... His shoulders are a little hampered because of his uh, design. And yeah, there's a little bit... His shoulders are a little hampered, but he still has the same articulation... And waist and everything, yeah. But yeah, those shoulders, because they're so massive, they can't move as much, unfortunately. But they're pretty okay, as they are. They also can combine into a uh, singular gun, and you uh, take that tab that goes together, take the arms and tab them back in. Ooh, dang. And you fold the hood back down. And you also take this peg right here and bring it out. 
It's really stiff. Him, much the same. Take the feet and keep them tabbed together. Take the hood and collapse it back up into the arms. The arms which should be tabbed into the side. So, yeah, take the hood and collapse it back up. Close that back up. And then here, this one you rotate around at the waist. And then you take this peg and you Yeah, so once it's like that, yeah, you take this peg and just that's so. And you also need to take these these legs. You probably need to adjust a little bit, like up a little bit, like that, just a tiny bit. And there you got the gun, at least the one they subscribe. You can do it the other way around if you want, but yeah, it's um. Kind of weak. There's the barrels, I guess. But yeah, it's kind of a weak gun. It's kind of like, I guess. Yeah, and you can be held. But um, yeah, it's kind of a weak gun, to be honest. It, it doesn't look very good. This is one of the ones that doesn't just simply doesn't look very good. It just, it just looks like two cars uh, pegged together or uh, something different if you're... Uh, a particular mindset so yeah it's they're all right just yeah they're pretty good i guess okay as robots and cars are pretty good looking just guns modes kind of crap and forgettable so there's that and swindler here is a kind of a pain just because of uh the way his hood works he's also a little limited because of the way his shoulders are and everything but yeah, they're they're all right. They're just I think unfortunately, and this is my personal disappointment. They're just kind of weak compared to the rest of the MicroMasters in the way, just because. Well, yeah, they're, I think they're a little just some just a little disappointing. And it just it's you know it sucks because I was Swindler was the one I was looking toward to the most because like oh hey new Swindler I was never expecting that and for some reason he doesn't want to stand anymore. So yeah, that's it. Um, hope you uh, found this informative or entertaining. I hope you like, comment, subscribe. I see you next time with another video review.